hello guys welcome back to my channel and uh, if you haven't subscribed i request you take your few seconds to subscribe to this channel so that whenever i upload another video like this you will be able to be notified now today we are discussing about how you can be able to start your movie shop in kenya so you might be having your computers and uh, you want to make use of them in terms of uh, opening a movie shop now here are some of the tips that i want you to uh, to follow so that it might help you or somebody around you it could be your neighbor your child or any other person or your friend cousin auntie people who have passion about this who are around you could benefit them now uh, if you are there and are wondering how much money you are supposed to spend in terms of opening this but for the start if you have a hundred thousand a hundred k you can start uh, this particular movie shop well apart from the amount i have mentioned to you that one hundred thousand you are supposed to have uh, certain things which will make your movie shop running well you can uh, break down that amount in terms of purchasing certain important things in your movie shop for example you are supposed to have a computer that should be the first thing uh, you are supposed to think of for example the computer which is good to run a movie shop supposed to range like 35 and above there so if you have a good computer with the good uh, uh, memory like if you have uh, the memory speed of 8 gb and and then above like you can have a good hard disk of two teras and you have some other hard disk which uh, which will supplement that one uh, it will work out for you um, because uh, you will be required to have a lot of movies so that uh, other customers will come to buy the movies from you you're not supposed only to save one movie you're supposed to have a variety of them because a lot of people will come to your shop asking for this movie for that movie and you don't have like two consecutive days we find that you are losing customers so for you to be up to date you are supposed to have movies you're supposed to download latest movies even those movies which people have watched some time back we're supposed to have them because uh, not every person is updated so sometimes someone can watch a movie which is uh, uh, the latest and uh, eventually they want to watch the the first uh, movie for example i'm talking about the series so you're supposed to be well equipped and uh, you are sub if you know that downloading them is a bit uh, tedious for you you are supposed to go to other movie shops where people are selling the test movies you can buy them in bulk so that you can uh, store those movies for your customers uh, apart from the computer you are supposed to have chairs and then the table yeah you're supposed to have the table where you can put uh, your computer on and then uh, you are supposed to have like a printer a colored printer where you'll be printing uh, posters uh, posters where you'll be uh, displaying them on the wall uh, so that whenever customers enter into your move shop you don't need a lot of explanation they'll only see the latest movies and what you have displayed on their wall you can either decide to make a, a board where you'll be displaying your uh, posters or you can just put it on a wall depending on how you want your uh, the movie shop to look like now having bought all those you are supposed to buy like uh, empty cds you can, they are they're just available in the market uh, like uh, you're supposed to buy the envelopes for cds uh, packaging and then having done that uh, that is not enough uh, so you have now started to operate the business you are supposed to have uh, uh, documents like licenses you are supposed to have music copyright license You're supposed to have film license and then uh, fire extinguisher and then the county government what license so if you have those things which means you are good to go so the government people will not be on your door asking you to do this to do that or they're they not going to come and confiscate your machine simply because you haven't uh, paid the amount for uh, for a certificate or what you'll be um, in a good what in a good hand or you'll be in a safe in a safe hand if you have those things 
well guys thank you so much for watching and listening to my advice and uh, uh, this discussion on how you can open a movie shop please if you haven't subscribed to my channel i request you take some few seconds to subscribe so that you become part of this channel see you in the next video